because he's live, you know. No, people don't know. You don't know. People are the, you're involved in this. It's an interactive night. What is happening now? People don't know how to watch live entertainment anymore because of show. This is entertainment on the television. I mean, I'm not on the TV as much as I was, to be honest. I can't cook. I hate pets and I haven't got any rubbish in the attic. Um, <laughs> <laughs> this is an interactive night, you see. People, shows like Big Brother, it's spoilt it, hasn't it? Yeah. Spoilt it. What, what is that entertainment? Us sat at home watching someone else sat at home. That's the best thing. I was watching the Big Brother show, a bloke laid on the sofa in his underpants, drinking lager out of a can, eating cornflakes out of the packet. And then I realised the television wasn't even on. <laughs> now, if... Well, here I am, comedian Paul Eastwood, 10 years in show business, getting the feedback, finding out what the general public think, and seeing how my name is spreading and getting the word on the street. Have you heard of comedian Paul Eastwood? No. OK, mate, sorry to trouble you. Look at the dog, man. Have you heard of comedian Paul Eastwood? Sure. OK, thank you. It's not panning out, is it? Sorry, have you heard of comedian Paul Eastwood? Uh, sure. Okay, thank you. But my show as a comedian is award winning, so if you don't like it, you're wrong. Um, well, here you are, you've caught me. Just uh, chilling out, taking a little bit of me time. This is the um, salon that I come to for the massage and the hair. And. Um, Alfonso, that I see regularly, he has no idea that um, I have a showbiz lifestyle. He thinks I'm just one of the normal customers that he has. But it's important to keep up appearances. It's nice to take a little bit of me time and escape the excitement of show business. Hi, I'm Paul Easter. Welcome to a brand new quiz show called A Grand in the Hand, where we give random everyday people the opportunity to win £1,000, yes, £1,000 in cash for answering three simple questions. This is Lee from Torquay. Your three questions away from £1,000. Okay, question number one. Right. What did little Bo Peep lose? Uh, sheep. That's absolutely right. Two questions away from a thousand pounds, Lee. Are you excited? Yeah, yeah. yeah okay, yeah. here we go. Second question. Mary had a little... Uh, lamb. lamb. She yeah. did indeed. Okay, two questions. Yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. One question to go. In the formula, yeah. what is the last digit of pi? Um, I'm going to have to hurry you. Hi, I'm award-winning comedian Paul Eastwood and these are old age pensioners. I love them and I try and support them. The main charity that I'm involved with is Age Concern. It's important to support the people that made this country a great institution and give a little bit back. Paul, Paul, what's with the CD, mate? What? What's with the CD? It's my CD. It doesn't amazing. work. Ditch it. Di I'm doing a little bit. Ditch it. My granddad's great, we call him uh, Spider-Man, you know, because he's light on his feet, but he can't get out of the bath. And, um, <laughs> I hate stupid people. I had a night off the other night, I phoned up one of those home delivery places. Do you know the home delivery Domino's Pizza? Do you know that? Hello, Domino's Pizza, Carl speaking. How may I help you? I said, well, have a guess, Carl. I said, have you got a sump for a 1600 Ford Cortina? <laughs> he said, no, we do pizzas. You ready to play? Yeah. OK, Steve, here we go. Question number one. Humpty who sat on a wall? Dumpty. Humpty Dumpty did sit on the wall. Two questions to go. Are you excited, Steve? I am, yeah. Thousand pounds, mate. Yeah. Thousand pounds. How many minutes in an hour? Minutes? Yeah. 
60. Six, 60, 60 minutes in an hour. You're absolutely right. Yeah. And the final question for a thousand pounds. How many times does the average American open the fridge door in a day? Granny man. Let's play. Uh, old MacDonald had what as a business? A farm. A farm, absolutely right. Are you excited, Anne? Yeah. Two questions, two questions, a thousand pounds tax free. Uh, which of the reindeer had a shiny nose? Rudolph. Rudolph, okay. In the formula, what is the last digit of pi? Paul Eastwood. Paul Eastwood. Oh, great. Oh, man, I think you're ace. Uh, so I've got some more CDs here. Can you oh, give it a Yes, yeah, we were just talking about oh, that. Oh, fantastic. Of course, okay. There you go. Yeah, Cheers, that's fantastic. fantastic. Just talking right. about that, obviously. You're great. You're great. You are. You're great. Who, who should I make it out to? Well, it's me, Steve, isn't it? What? Steve, you just asked me to come over when you're on camera and ask me to sign your CD just go, for you. Mate. Just go. Just go. Just cut that. Excuse me, mate. In a minute, I'm going to come up to you on the camera. Okay, it's nothing yeah. to worry about. I'm going to ask you if you've heard of the comedian Paul Eastwood. Yeah, sure. And if you just say yes, okay? Yeah, yeah. So, yeah. Okay. Just say yeah. Okay, that's for you. Yeah. So you know what to do. I'll oh, come quid. Yeah, it's fine. Yeah. Then. yeah. Sure. I'll say good night to you with this. Let's do it, nice. Thank you. Good night. Well, here I am getting feedback on the streets, uh, stopping random people and asking them how my name is spreading. Have they heard of comedian Paul Eastwood? Let's do it. Oh, here's a over here. Excuse me, mate. Uh, have you heard of comedian Paul Eastwood? Um, yes, yes, yeah, yeah. Brilliant. Thank you very much indeed. Well. Nice Thank to you. meet you. I'm uh, you. Paul Eastwood. Nice Great. to see you. I'll Cheers, see you mate. Too Thanks buddy. very much. Well, the word on the street is good. They've heard of comedian Paul Eastwood.